this project we will need the 3D printed parts, double-sided sticky tape and super glue. The assembly is super simple so right now I'm gonna show you a time lapse of me assembling it but it should be pretty straightforward. The first thing I'm going to assemble is the extruder. These are all the pieces you need for one extruder. The extruder is gonna be your keychain, so let's get started. Right now, all we need to do is uh, press fit everything together because we don't need more glue for the rest of the assembly. In order for you to stick this to the wall, which means this, you will need a double-sided tape. You will put some double-sided tape here and here. Of course, remove your extruders. When you do this, then you press it firmly against the wall and you wait 24 hours. And that should be enough time for you to, to start using it. And in case you want to know how I slice my files, I'm going to show it to you right now. I'm going to quickly show you how we're going to slice everything. These four models can be sliced together. Well, these three models, the Hotten, the, the rods, and the bearing can be sliced together. If we slice it, you will see that I added a color change right here. This is because I want my hot end to be silver and gold. And I also added a brim to the rods so they stick to, to the build plate and well, nothing for the bearings. So let's continue, let's, let's move on to the next one. For, for the carriage, the extruder and the sides, which will, we will need two of them. We don't need to do anything, just place them on your peel plate and slice it, and that's pretty much it. For the motors, uh, I have three of them here because I'm planning to hang three keys. And if I slice it, you will see that I added right around this height a color change. This is because I want to simulate the silver part of the motor. And the, the height it does not has to be the exact same one as I'm using. You can use whatever you want. This is a personal preference, but well, this is how you slice the motors. And finally, the fans. This is quite simple. You just place the fans on the wheel plate and slice it, and that's it. I just wanted to show you what it looks like if you print everything you need to hang three keys. If you're planning to hang three keys, this is everything you will need to print. And of course, if you want to hang more, this is everything you will need to duplicate so if you add an extra copy of all these things i selected you will hang an extra key just in case you don't want to have a bulky keychain with your keys i made another version where the keychain is just a hot end and it is magnetic so you magnetically attach it to the to the hole in the extruder Okay guys, and finally, if you like what I do, maybe consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. And if you want to get access to all my files, maybe join my Patreon, which will also give you commercial rights to sell prints of my files. And well, that's it. See you next time.